After Thomas Cole's untimely death in 1848, a new wave of Hudson River school artists emerged, including his prized pupil Frederick Edwin Church, along with John Frederick Kinsett and Sanford Robinson Gifford. Their works, characterized by luminous qualities, became synonymous with luminism. Notably, Kinsett, Gifford, and Church played pivotal roles in founding the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York City. During the years spanning 1855 to 1875, the second generation of Hudson River School painters produced their most exemplary works. Artists like Frederick Edwin Church and Albert Bierstadt rose to fame during this period, drawing inspiration from the Dusseldorf School of Painting, with Bierstadt having studied there extensively. Their colossal landscapes, such as Niagara and the Icebergs, attracted thousands of viewers willing to pay 25 cents each. These paintings represented an unprecedented scale in American art, evoking the vast and majestic wilderness of the country. This era coincided with the westward expansion, the preservation of national parks, and the creation of urban green spaces, 